Hi there, and welcome to day three of Back to Basics. I'm Chris McEwen of cmanim.com, and today we're talking about why am I doing Back to Basics? So, I'm a graduate from Leeds Beckett University for studying computer animation and special effects. And I'd like to start having my degree pay for itself. So to get animation jobs, I need to do some good animation. So I'm starting at the bottom with Back to Basics. As you've seen in the first two days, I've been working on the bouncing ball. Day one was just the standard bouncing ball with some squash and stretch and some easing. I didn't particularly go into the squashing and the stretching and the easing as much as I could have. But I'm saving that for a later example. Uh, possibly either this week or maybe next. And day two was the bowling ball, which didn't involve squash and stretch because of how a bowling ball is. And the easing, again, I didn't go into it as much because future. And today, a video blog. Different format, I'd like to do video blogs every now and then, just to uh, let you know of like, the progress of things, what's happening with me, all that kind of good stuff. And it's an easy day. <laughs> it's not, there's a hell of a lot of editing that you won't see that I've got to do with this. So, aside from that, I'm also doing Back to Basics to help you. I mean, if you're having creative block or whatever you want to call it, so am I. I'm forcing myself to work through this and if I can do it, you can do it too. So let's work through this together and we'll come out with something pretty good at the end of it, I hope. So the future of Back to Basics, where's it going to go? Well, I've still got a hell of a lot to work through with it. I mean, there's 12 principles of animation and there's a hell of a lot of examples you can do in each of those. So I've got a lot of things to work through. Between the different examples. I've got these video blogs I can do just to let you know how things are going, I mean how things are with me. Because if you go onto my blog which will be linked below, uh, you'll you'll find different posts about things that I'm doing, uh, just generally what's going on in here. And you know you might find it useful yourself if you're going through similar things. But a little bit about me. So why why are you gonna give me your time? Because whenever you watch this, no matter how many seconds, minutes, whatever you spend watching my things, that's time out of your day. So I need to be giving you something, but I need to tell you why you should care. So, about me. So I've been animating for about 14 years now, and three of those years have been at university, where I was using CG. Uh, animation programs like Maya and 3DS Max. Before that I was doing 2D animation using Flash. And I want to look into using Toon Boom as well but that could be a different thing completely. Yeah. As I say I've been doing animation for 14 years and my very early Flash I didn't know the principles of animation and I was learning things as I was, as I was going along. Easing in and out was just does this look right? No. How about this? Looks a bit better. I mean, it was always, does it look right? That's how I was learning these principles of animation without actually knowing it. I mean, some examples of my early animation, I mean, they don't look great, but they were fun to make. These were probably the best times I had animating. Now though, my skills have gone up a little bit. It takes me a bit longer to make these things, and, well, it can be a bit of a drain, and I need to just, be creative with it. So, I mean, as you can see, I've done a cat run, because I like cats. I've got a cat. I like cats. I like cats. It's a world apart from my old stuff. So, going forward, what do you want to see? I can tailor things to what you guys want to see, or I can just make it up as I'm going along, which is kind of how I've started. So. Well, that's all the time I've got for this. So, I'm Chris McEwen of cmanim.com. If you've enjoyed this, like, comment, subscribe, share it with your friends, and, well, I'll see you tomorrow.